Hey everybody, this is Happy Gamer, and I've been playing Knights for the last week or so every day, every day, trying to figure out how to bring you a tactics video to kick ass with Imperial Knights. A lot of people are feeling sad now. Knights are not as tough as they thought they were. They do die, and they actually can die pretty fucking quickly. So, how do you not die? Tactics video, Knight Errant. Let me tell you, I call it The Box. I play a Sisters of Battle army, and I've taken the Knight Errant in my army as an ally, and I, well, first of all, my Sisters of Battle kicked ass anyway, but now they are even better, and here's why. I take Rhinos. Rhino, 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 with another Rhino, and I create a box. One Rhino in front, two Rhinos on the side, one Rhino in the rear, if you're especially paranoid, and they just walk up. Walk up. Boom, boom, boom. You'll find that the rhinos are exactly the right size to give your knight a cover save. Fuck your ion shield. Cover save. Put your ion shield wherever you think you might get hit by something that won't take a cover save. But before that, it's just the right height behind a vehicle. And even if they get blown up, it's still there. They walk up. My knight errant with a rhino on each four side, walking up, shooting until it gets into hand-to-hand -hand range, and then it assaults. Right after the rhino's tank shock, by the way. I have found this to be brilliant, because you also have to remind... Actually, let me tell you a little thing I came up with the best. I put an immolator at the back arc. Why? Because friendly units don't block. Of course, this is a vehicle, but I still move it a little bit to the side. Whatever. The rear is not that much of a threat. I just put it a little bit to the side or this there or whatever. A little gap between the rhinos and the uh, and the and the and the, um, the knight, and you can just shoot right in between it. It's not like you need a huge space. The real point is, other people have to shoot over, through, around the rhino before it can hit. The knight directly. Many of them decide to blow up the rhino, but that's still one more turn, one more weapon, shoot at the rhino, and it's even better for the sisters because they get that six plus in vol save. This is my secret to knight survival. Put them in a box of vehicles, and then when you get to close range, when you get to butt stomping time, just move them out of the way. Or even better, I drop all my sisters, in this case Celestines, out of them. And people don't know what to shoot. Do we shoot the knight? Well, if we shoot the knight, then we got freaking 30, yeah, 30 Celestines are marching right off of you and, uh, and, and, and the rhinos are okay. Or do we shoot the rhinos and try to kill the sisters? In which case, the knight is walking up. Okay, trust me, nobody is being destroyed that quickly. Nobody's dying in one turn. You're talking three turns, and these guys, they can pretty much move up in three turns. And even if the walker is walking, uh, he's still shooting, and the rhinos in that last turn, they do that, they, they zoom up ahead, do their tank shock, drop off the Celestines, have them engage, and then in that last turn, or le uh, uh, then the knight walks up and charges. This is my strategy for you. Try it. Next is going to be Night Paladin. Enjoy! Bye!